This video shows how to set up a local printer within POS Pizza. Before you attempt to configure the printer settings within POS Pizza, you must successfully set up the printer on your computer and print a test page. This means that you must physically connect the printer to the computer or network. Then install the necessary print drivers for your printer. You must be able to view the printer in your local control panel. Then, you must print a test page from each station that will be using the printer. If Windows cannot print a test page, then POS Pizza cannot either. If you are having trouble printing the test page, contact your POS hardware provider or consider hiring a network professional to handle this for you. Once the printers are properly functioning on each computer, continue with this video. If the test page works, great! Now you can begin to set it up in POS Pizza. First you may want to set up your general printing rules for your system. So, run the Management Utility Program, click Configure on the toolbar, then select Global System Configurations. Go to the Printing Options tab. The Printing Options tab allows you to control when you want to print and, if you do want to print, which printers are used. Current settings are set so, when order is first placed in the system, printer always prints the receipt for every order. The initial slips will print to the selected printers 2, 3, and 4. The printing options also exist for order edits and cashing out. Change any of these default settings to meet your specific needs. Once you are ready, save and exit. Next, you will need to tell POS Pizza about the printer that you just installed. First, click on the local machine configurations. On the general settings page under the section labeled miscellaneous options, place a check in the box labeled use receipt printer. If you will be printing delivery directions on the receipts, go to the bottom half of this page and check the option same as receipt printer. Next, click on the printer settings. Your printer options will be displayed. This will simply allow you to customize information that is printed on receipts. Go to the lower half of the screen to Printer Selections and select the type of printer that you are using from the left side drop down list. The most common receipt printer types are listed here as well as standard page printer types. These are Epson Thermal and Impact, Star Thermal and Impact, Citizen, and some generic types. Choose the one that best meets your printer's description. In this example, we will use the Epson TM models. After choosing the type of printer that you are using, choose the printer's driver from the right side drop down list. Using the specific printer driver is recommended, but you can also choose to simply use the default printer as well. If you choose to use the default printer, you will need to ensure that your printer is set up as the default driver in the control panel. If you are adding additional receipt printers, you can use printers number 2, number 3, and number 4 slots for these extra printers. Click Save and Exit to save your local settings. You should now run the main POS module at this computer and do some test printing by either using the Reprint Receipt button or by submitting a few test orders. Repeat these steps for every local printer that you wish to install.